everyone small games promoter here we are playing low polis this is a uh, sort of a strategy game city builder which is very sort of pixelated graphics kind of really interesting it's got a different outlook on things the uh, indie developers uh, from the looks from what i read um are very um you know trying to do this part time as well as uh working and stuff like that and doing other things which is cool and uh, I'm really interested in a different style of um, strategy games to try and I, I picked this one up and um, you can try it on each style and um, I'm gonna pick up some music for the game because I, there's no music in it so I hope that the music does fit with the, the game itself uh, do you need a brief introduction to the game uh, yeah let's go for yes all roads lead to victory. Road is a basic structure that connects building in your city and it makes transport resources possible. Constructions can be placed only by the road. Build the road. Accept. Okay, so we're building a the road. Let's just pause it for now. Uh, There we go, we're gonna build it up to here. Those who give a hand. To make use of resources, you will need people running transport, storehouses, uh, is bu uh, building used for collecting goods and nearby production buildings. You may also use storehouses to expand your building zone. Build a storehouse. Let's accept that as well. Uh, nice. Perfect place. There we go. City of wood and stone. You will need wood and stone to build anything. To get wood, you need the lumberjack and a quarry to produce stone. You may have to expand your building zone to reach the resources you need. Build a lumberjack and a quarry. Uh, okay. So, lumberjack. Can't click on this for now. Lumberjack. It needs a road. Okay, so I would like to get it like a little bit further in there. Let's have a look, lumberjack. So does it? Oh, automatically rotates the building. That is awesome. All right, let's do it like that. That's good for me. And we also want to quarry. Uh, let's see, where's the... Whoa, 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 okay. Alright, so that's the quarry there. I think we can build that there. So let's build the road all the way to... Oh, wait, sorry. All the way to that and to that. And then quarry... F oh, nice. Here we go. That's got really good details. I'm really enjoying this. Um, right, what's this? That's the name of our land, I'm assuming. Income is going up. Which is fine. I would like to be able to zoom a little bit more, but it looks really nice so far. I'm gonna follow this game to see if what things will be introduced. So this our Etoland. This is our city hall. It's got doesn't show the inhabitants. I don't have. Oh right, okay, right. Probably need to build some houses maybe forester lumberjacks why can i not build a house village buildings um, how do i get people in that's the lumberjack that's a forester What does a forester do? Maintain forest by planting trees. Can only be placed within existing trees range. Okay. Probably something like that. We don't want the trees to disappear, so ideally. Um, can we speed up? This is day 22.
day 22 store 300 wood and 300 stone oh sorry I just realized apologies I probably missed a bit of time there I didn't get uh, the road built far enough the graphics you know are not all there but for what the game is trying to do it's pretty good a bit more polish and then you know a couple more things added on and the buildings really really nice the animation obviously it's still something that's working with like people's animation maybe a little bit more zooming in the ability to do that would be nice too that needs to be fixed because obviously there are inhabitants or should allow me to build homes home sweet home build a hut okay a hut here we go build a fishery build another hat first okay and now we will build a fishery a fishery this building needs to be placed next to the water something tells me that it needs to be on deep water This building has to be placed on the water, like that. Getting confused here. Right, let's pause this for a second. Oh, maybe uh, like that, something like that. Oh, here we go. I found it. Nice. There we go. That is awesome. Okay, so you build a little bridge, and then people come in and bring in food. So food should be going up now. How many people? So 21 inhabitants for two homes. 22 now. Producer is not supported by a storehouse. What producer is that? Oh, okay. Probably that would be better. Here we go. So economy wise we're going down by 249 coal coins per whatever it is. Food is going up though. Uh, store product. This is where the fun begins. Build the marketplace. There we go. Right in the middle. Watcher, leather product need, marketplace access, church access, we don't have church. Okay, right, so that gives access to 
for people's happiness, increases people's happiness. That's pretty good. Um, um, so it's a bit of a settler's kind of like you have to probably upgrade your buildings at some point. Stuff like that. You can get well. Let's do a well here. Do a hunter, a tanner. And we can do a tanner. What else can we do? A shrine. That'll be nice. So that will make people happy. Tanner, this guy will This guy, this guy will get all sorts of animals and this guy will make leathers and there we go look at that happiness 86 that is awesome which which one no it's fine it is supported I build these so it's fine now uh, we can do a well a marketplace a fishery a quarry a lumberjack we've done that a forester we've done it a hut we have it is that all the buildings we have so far? Can we upgrade any of these things? Yay, that's what I'm talking about. So now we've upgraded. Uh, right, let's build some more huts then. And let's try and. Let's try and build some more huts here. Needs a road. Okay. <laughs> so now the citizens live in. Can you get upgraded buildings? That is the question. Oh, here we go. Small town buildings. We got road bridges. Medics. Tavern, farmer, windmill, bakery, sheep farm, weaver, winery, decorative tree, and fountain. Can we upgrade these storehouses or do we need to expand your city and So what to do here is maybe okay let's do a storehouse level 2 and then we can do a medic cures stuff nice uh, that's the medic we can do a tavern but I bet you in anything the taverns will cost money to maintain. Farmer. Nice, look at that. We're building up. Uh, we need a windmill. There's an obstacle. I guess you cannot upgrade your buildings. I don't have enough raw materials. What am I missing? Oh, I need more wood. Uh, lumberjack, maybe? Just get another lumberjack. That'd be good. to think something about money though because it's really affecting us here finances don't look our greatest let's 
does it have access to these resources? Yeah, so it doesn't look like it's a range thing. I mean... So if I increase a little bit of the money that they pay, would that make it better? Maybe these guys can pay a little bit more because they can afford it. Here we go. Eh, we don't need that much, but you know. Okay, so it needs more products. They're not very happy because they don't have these products. So it needs cloth, it needs wine. Wow, man. Needs a lot of things. Uh, how are we doing? We're getting more resources, so that's fine. Um, right, we were building a windmill here. <coughs> we need another storehouse. Actually, let's just get all the way up here. Good, good, good. good. Do a bakery produces food from flour. Need just a few more resources though. Congratulations, you have citizens. Fire is spreading. Oh my god, what? No, 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 no. Oh dear, that's not good. We need a well. Jesus. Okay, apparently we need this another storehouse. All uh, right. Okay. Let's try and get a uh, bakery here. Here we go. Oh my God, we're still losing gold. What's this? Oh, that's our shrine. The tax level stopping the house from upgrading. I know. Just need to get more houses then. That's the only thing I can think of. There we go. <coughs> Let's try and build a road like this. More huts. We need more huts. We need more huts. Oh, that messed up my road. Oh, damn it. It's still not enough. Whoa. Not enough raw materials. Jeez. Okay, right, so with this going on, I can maybe bring it down a notch. Just enough for... Apparently, this needs to be in the green. What? Okay, come on. Don't be silly. Yeah, I shouldn't mess with this taxes. This 
still says the tax level is to stopping the house from upgrading. What are you talking about? Lowered your tax all the way down. Uh, Jesus. House is ready for our upgrade. Okay, okay, all right, okay. It should give me more money now that uh, that it's upgrading it, right? Hot. Don't have enough raw materials. How many raw materials does it take? Fire spreading. What? <gasps> no. The treasure is nearly empty. Yes, wood is running low. I know that. Uh, there's no fire there. It's okay. So obviously, it looks like the game is not gonna let me. Oh no, it is. I'm getting in under. But anyhow, this is the game so far. I am really enjoying it. It looks, it reminds me a lot of Settlers, where you can build different buildings and sort of increase your housing and things like that. I'm gonna give it another shot. And um, obviously now the finances, I need to look over it a little bit better. I was trying to get all excited with building everything. And um, wow, looks, this is a medic, sorry. I thought it was like the third house. I would like to get the maximum of happiness so I can get as many people as in and um, but yeah this is the first training help thanks so much for watching I hope you've enjoyed it I will see you all in the next episode of this awesome game and um, so I will see you all next time bye bye